So yo 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 It's been a long time man I'm back with another one And on this one guys we're gonna talk about like Why spirituality In general is much More powerful than Religion You understand Even though religion has much more traction So like you have to understand that like when we talk about the religion, we're talking about like the densest form of spirituality, you understand? Like the most saturated. So, you have to understand that like, religion is a much more saturated form of spirituality, you understand? Much more dense form of spirituality. So spirituality is just simple, you understand? When someone, when someone says they are spiritual, it means that they are looking at things from the essence, you understand? They don't just, they don't just like look at things from the external or even from the internal. But no, they just look at the essence of whatever it is that they are trying to understand. And then by doing that, whatever it is that you're trying to find out is going to pop up, you understand, in your mind or somewhere in the universe so that you can receive it, you understand. So like, the reason that spirituality is much more powerful than religion, even though religion has much more, way, way much more traction than spirituality. So a lot of people in the world, um, like there's a lot of religious people in the world, more than there is spiritual people, I understand? But still, people who practice spirituality are much more powerful, way, way, way powerful than people who are into religion, I understand? They know that people who are into spirituality, they know the broader view of the truth, you know. They understand the broader perspective of the truth, of life, of everything. Religion just boxes you into... And mind you, I'm not comparing these things, I understand. I'm just so showing you the differences and similarities, which basically when they add up, is just one thing. They are working towards one purpose. I understand. So like now the reason people who are spiritual are much more powerful, like people more than people who are religious, is because people who are religious are looking into the material, the physical, you know, the external, the internal. I understand. But people who are spiritual, they look at the essence, you know, the vibration, the frequency, you know, things like that. And it's natural, just in the very same way people who are religious look at materialistic things and tie them to spiritual things. People who are spiritual look at non-materialistic things and tie them to spiritual experiences, I understand? Things like feelings, energy, whatever. But none of those belong to either. Physical things don't belong to the religion and non-physical things don't belong to the spirit, I understand? It's just parts and bits of this creation, I understand? That adds up just to one thing. So I'm just trying to show you that people who are spiritual, they can easily get to understand everything about the world than people who are religious mainly because they focus on the essence you know the closest form to the actual uh, source of creation understand so whatever that's creating this thing whatever this intelligence is 
if there is something that is close to how that looks in formation is like spirituality you understand so you have to pay attention to the things that influence you you know things like if you are being influenced by external things like that you know you are pretty much a religious person whether you pray or not and if you focus on the essence the 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 you know the no thing the imagination the subconscious the befores it becomes something if you can focus on that then you're gonna understand like the essence of things you understand and you're gonna know the true nature of things not just the physical nature of things you understand and that like physicality and spirituality are just different sides of the coin but what we are looking at are not those sides we are looking at the coin you understand so the coin is the essence not even the coin is not even the essence but it's just the closest form to the essence i understand and we can look at spirituality so that we can see how the coin is formed or created you understand so like yo 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 i hope you get it man that's just my explanation you know my observation of like why spirituality is much more powerful than religion as i said it's just two sides of the coin but the other one it has like i don't even want to compare them because it's just the same thing but like with the other one because life doesn't begin here and it doesn't end here with the other one it's going to take you a whole lot of way you understand a whole lot of things for you to actually live i understand and actually understand the purpose of existence but with physicality that's what's gonna happen but with spirituality it's gonna you're gonna quickly understand it you know you might even understand it in this lifetime you understand oh in the next lifetime but at least you're gonna be close to it you know because as i said life doesn't end here and it doesn't begin here you know it, it goes way beyond the universe you understand we are just a, a molecule of life there are trillions and bi- like i don't even know the number but there's like a lot of molecules and th- what we are living in right now is just a form a single form of molecule you understand it just one one of it you know one of them <laughs> type shit you know because all of this they make up one thing again so it's like one of many of one of many anyway he be sold in the building man he the sub if you like this content and if you enjoyed my video this one hit that like man yeah 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 he be sold in the building man do what you gotta do i don't give a call man yeah 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 see you on the next one